for you to do. That gives you purpose. Mm -hmm. It gives you significance. You have something significant to do. But you know what? There's going to be so many people in places, in social media, that are going to get in the way. There's become so many voices that are going to say, oh, that really, that, that plan that God has for you, I don't even know if that's really real. That plan that God has for you, you shouldn't really listen to it. That plan that God has for it, ah, yeah. choose fame and success and power and platform and likes and social media. Choose that instead. You see, in life, we're, we're going to hear so many voices that are calling out to us, saying, choose me, choose me, choose me. I remember when I got to the University of Florida and we would pull up to the home games at the swamp and we would, we would get off the bus and we would walk through what's called the Gator Walk. And for average games, there would be 15, 20,000 people. For big games, there would be 30, 40,000 people waiting there to greet you when you get off the bus. And, and you're walking through this pathway to walk into the stadium. And it's a, kind of a surreal feeling. It's awesome. Like, I mean, I'm 18 years old and you're walking through this and it's crazy. It's, and at first it was really cool and exciting and it would even sort of give you a little confidence because you'd see people wearing your jersey and they'd be like, all right, we love you. And then you would see a, a mom with her boy and you'd be like, oh, you're our kid's role model. You see, but then what would also creep in is a lot of other voices. Like, well, if you knew me on my worst day, I probably wouldn't be your son's role model anymore. But wait a second, in the next few hours, if I don't play good, I'm also going to get booed. I'll be hated. I'll be disliked. And so there's these voices of, well, shame and guilt, but then also the voices that I'm not enough. And so on one hand, I was like, dang, I'm, I'm pretty cool. There's a lot of people wearing my jersey here. There's a lot of people excited to see me. So then I'll start to get full of a lot of pride. Like maybe I'm somebody. But then the next second, it would be all of a sudden like, oh my gosh, if they really, if they really knew me, 